Hello and welcome to a new video on my channel, thanks for tuning in. Last time we built a power supply for our amp. You can check out this video on my channel if you haven't seen it yet. Today we go for the main board. This wiring diagram should lead you through the build. You can see the values of any component and how it's wired. For example, if we take R2, the first resistor on our board, then you can find its value on the wiring scheme. There it is, it has 68 kilo ohm. So let's jump into the build. I start with fitting in the resistors. Therefore, I move from left to right on the wiring scheme to make no mistakes. I double check everything before soldering. Then I soldered the resistors to the board. Make sure not to solder the outer holes. We need these afterwards for wiring and connecting. Then I moved on to the capacitors. The blue ones have a polarity, so you have to match their notch to the negative side on the board. You also can see this on the wiring scheme. These two capacitors I placed a bit different to keep the axis to the hole. We need this afterwards to mount the board into the chassis. After cutting off the legs we are ready with our main board, but keep the legs, you can use them as wire straps afterwards. When you made everything right, your board should look like this. Then I started to prepare the chassis for our components. When mounting the power supply, make sure the red film capacitors face towards the hole for our power plug. Here I fit in the edge protector for the cables. Make sure the tube sockets sit in the right way before tighten them. This is the toroidal transformer. Because I already mounted the power supply I had some issues with tightening it, but in the end it worked very well. Our Hammond transformer didn't sit even so I used two nuts as a spacer and then tightened it to the chassis. Time for our front plate. I'm mounting the inputs, the potties, the stages light and the power switch. On the back we have the power plug, a fuse and the output jack. And that's it for today. Next time we will go for some wiring and take a look at the head shell. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions feel free to ask me in the comment section below. I would appreciate 
a like or a subscription if you want to stay updated about the rest of this build. Thank you very much for watching. I hope to see you in the next video. Cheers and goodbye.